You can configure your FortiGate to become a secure web gateway using a proxy. Now, you can use either explicit proxy or a transparent proxy. When using explicit proxy, you will need to add up the IP address of the proxy itself, either manually in the browser or using a PAC file. When using a transparent proxy, nothing needs to be done. Now, we will use an explicit proxy on our Ubuntu device, so let's start. Configuring explicit proxy involves some steps, so we will walk those steps one by one. The very first thing, if you haven't enabled explicit proxy before, just move to system, feature visibility, and make sure that the explicit proxy is on. It is enabled. Apply. The second thing to do on the interface that you wish to apply the explicit proxy, just edit that interface. And at the end, you will also find explicit web proxy that should also be enabled. Okay, the third thing, explicit proxy again, network explicit proxy. Here you can see that it is enabled on our LAN interface. The HTTP port is 8080. And here we actually enable the proxy auto configuration. Let's just edit the configuration file. We can see that if we have a host that is at the 10.0.5.7, that's our Ubuntu host, that's our mask direct him to the proxy at the 10.0.5.1.8080. Apply that. Now, the proxy pack file have its own URL. You can use your command line, get web proxy explicit, and here you will find the syntax, which is HTTP, uh, the address of that interface, the port, slash proxy.pack so we need to enter that at the proxy configuration in our browser either firefox or chrome all right now that we have actually configured our explicit web proxy let's move to policy and let's create a proxy policy we have already have one here let's edit our proxy policy we can see that we have explicit web proxy policy enabled on port 2 the outgoing interface is our WAN interface let's just let's not limit it to specific sources we will enable it to all users without any credentials whatsoever so the source will be all destination all schedule always service is web proxy all right now here you can apply security profiles we can apply uh, application control, antivirus, any security profile, the same as you would do on any other policy. So we have our policy, we have our explicit proxy pack configuration um, customized to our client, and the next thing to do is to move to our Ubuntu device. All right, so here, let's just open up our Ubuntu device. And let's move to preferences, proxy, and we can set the proxy manually, which is at the 10.0.5.1. We can also set it uh, using the automatic proxy configuration URL. And now let's just move to you know what, let's open up Wireshark, let's capture the traffic, and let's just move to YouTube again, and white. And here we can see that we have connections, we have sessions coming out from the 10.5.7, which is our Ubuntu device, towards 10.0.5.1, port 8080, which is our proxy port. 